Hey, what's up guys? Just getting my biceps um, using the preacher curls. Um, I love the preacher curls because the preacher curl machine is actually one of the machines that really isolates your biceps. Um, so you don't really have to use all your synergistic muscles to stabilize because it's already been stabilized for you. And I'm doing this video today to help and educate you guys out there about this machine. Um, this is where you see a lot of biceps tear. People just blow up their, their biceps using this machine because they're not using this machine the proper way. It's either they're putting too much load, not maintaining the angles, the tempo is too fast. So in order for you to protect your biceps and also your elbow, this is the proper way to do um, the preacher curls. First of all, weight on the belt, weight on the load. Make sure you don't use too much weight because at the end of the day is how much contraction you activate in the muscle that builds the muscle, not how much weight you're really moving. Even though you need some weight to help activate the muscle, but be really careful, especially with this machine. The first mistake I see that a lot of people do is when they're about to pick up the handle from this position, they lock their elbows and they try to pull from this position. If you pull from this position because your elbows are too straight and locked, they're gonna to be too much stress on the lower side of your biceps and behind your elbow. So this can really cause a lot of stress and can actually tear your biceps tendon from the bottom. So the first thing you wanna do is lean over, bend your elbows first. Bend your elbows and just sit back down. So my elbow now is in slightly bent, so it's not straight. And when you curl, make sure you curl really slow and when you come down, do not extend your elbows all the way down. You keep your elbows bent right about here, and then you curl back from your biceps, squeeze at the top, come down really slow, and stop right about there. So by stopping there, you're really protecting and maintaining muscle activation. You're protecting your elbows and your biceps and also maintaining muscle activation and muscle tension in the muscle. You squeeze right there and come down slow. So I'm not gonna even try to use the machine to show you what people do when they do this exercise. They're going too fast, locking their elbows, slamming their elbows down. So what that will do, because this pad here is already stabilizing the back of your arm. So it's gonna put a lot of stress in the back of the elbows, like I said, and the biceps. So please be careful when you're doing the preacher curls. Do not blow up your elbows or tear your, I mean, do not tear your biceps. Make sure you bend your elbows slightly. I'm gonna do it again, right about there. And then you sit back down. Make sure you use your biceps to pull your wrist and not your wrist first. If you can see, I actually have my grip a little bit looser and you squeeze at the top. So when you wanna let go of the machine, of the handle, lean over and let it go right there. Instead of letting it go right here because I've seen a lot of people with, you know, biceps tear, most especially on this machine. So train carefully, train smart. The tip of the day is keep your elbows bent slightly while you're doing the preacher curls. This is Mojo Lua from Miami Muscle. I'm out. So I'm getting back to my bicep curl. There we go. Nice and easy. Gotta talk to those biceps to grow mind muscle connection and then you use your words and energy to talk to your muscle right about there there we go set it down